Some business owners across the Central Coast are beginning to board up their windows amid protests. Let's get to KSPY News reporter Alexa Bertola live in San Luis Obispo to explain where this is happening. Alexa. Karina, several businesses here along Monterey Street, as well as some on Higuera Street, have decided to board up. Now businesses in Paso Robles have also done the same. One business after another after another in downtown Slow and Paso Robles have decided to close up shop and board up. Actually, it was a really hard decision for us to do that. I, I just thought, man, we live in Paso Robles. Remax Parkside on 12th Street in Paso Robles boarded up just before 5 Tuesday evening, sending staff home early. Just seeing what happened in San Luis the night before, we just thought, you know what, better safe than sorry, lots of glass, a lot of computers, a lot of documents here at the real estate office. The office took them down Wednesday morning following yesterday's peaceful protest. And I just thought, man, you know, one broken glass, a thousand dollars, you know, a couple of boards, 250 bucks. Down the street, Siegel's Jewelry also put up wood in protection. We were advised to, to board up and close uh, until uh, the, everything subsides. The shop, like many others, opened weeks ago after being closed for months due to COVID-19 to only close again. It's a major revenue loss. The business says it hopes to reopen Friday morning. It's going to be major right now that the, uh, the local support is going to be the biggest influence on keeping small businesses going. As for when the other shops will take down their boards, that's to be determined. A lot of the boards here in San Luis Obispo went up late yesterday as well as today. For now, live in San Luis Obispo, Alexa Bertola, KSBY News.